We begin tonight with breaking news. The firefighter killed battling a massive brush fire that was sparked by a gender reveal party has been identified as San Diego native Charles Morton. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Marcella Lee. And I'm Barbara Lee Edwards. The 39 year old was a crew boss for the Big Bear Hot Shots. He died on Thursday while trying to contain the El Dorado wildfire burning in the San Bernardino National Forest. That fire has now burned more than 22,000 acres over the last 15 days. Tonight, Joy Benedict shows us how friends and family are remembering Morton, who was born here in San Diego. Taken with a smoky background and wearing a big smile. It's a photo touching hearts on social media as the caption reads, end of watch. This photo has been shared almost 50,000 times on Facebook of the firefighter who lost his life battling the El Dorado fire. The post comes from his father who identifies the man as Charles Edward Morton, a crew boss for the Big Bear Hot Shots. And although the U.S. Forest Service has yet to officially identify the firefighter who went missing, and was found dead last week, family and friends have offered up prayers, love, and support to this man and his family. He's described as a wonderful person and a true hero. Someone else added, I would often think about Chuck when I saw California fires on the news. He loved his job, and now he is in the arms of Jesus. Although we don't know what caused his death, we know the Big Bear Hotshot team had been battling the El Dorado fire and before that the Apple fire, as this photo of the team was posted in August by the U.S. Hotshots Association. They also posted a photo of this belt buckle after his death, writing, Rest easy, brother. May the wind be at your back. Hotshot firefighters are some of the most highly trained assigned to the most challenging terrain. They are a hand crew of about two dozen who work in remote areas for an extended period of time with little support and although we don't know much about Charles Morton it's clear from the procession that escorted his body out of the mountains and the outpouring of support online he was a man a firefighter and a hero who will be missed Morton's death is currently under investigation and it's not clear yet whether the people responsible for starting that fire will face charges